so uh, thank you quintin for speaking to arvind resal and i nice having you with us today very nice to meet you thank you for having me uh, thank you valit for uh, speaking to arvind resal nice having you with us today thank you very much uh, i'm 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 very glad to be here and thank you for the interview let's start with an overview of hyperfusion uh, like your core business and the solutions you offer 100% so hyperfusion is an ai neo cloud so the difference with uh, traditional cloud is that we focus on ai uh, computing so anything related to training of models of ais and doing inferencing and hyperfusion now is the largest largest privately operated uh, ai neo cloud in the uae and uh, your recent expansion into middle east what sort what what motivated you to get into this market so you know ai works on like two fundamentals so there is uh you know of course the the energy aspect is very important for us to be able to have the size of the clusters but also the latency aspect was very compelling for us because we realized that if you wanted to scale for you know nearly, nearly 2.2 billion people which is in indian subcontinent pakistan in east africa the best way to do ai computing related to latency was actually in the uae uh, thanks to the fujera connection hub to submarine internet cables uh, we would like to start with a brief about your partnership with hyperfusion and uh, what sort of products and solutions will you offer on the market yeah so as as you know uh, currently with the adoption of ai uh, technologies and use cases uh, there is a need for uh, for an, an a cutting edge infrastructure that can cater for the needs of the ai use cases uh omnix as a service provider we help customers to adopt the technology we help them to identify the use cases we help them to um mean uh, select what would be the best use case for them the roi uh, out of the use case however of course at the time of the deployment or even at the time of testing the use case you need an infrastructure to support uh, that so that's why uh it was very uh, important for us to partner with hyperfusion because they can provide this required uh infrastructure for us to be able to help customers with the test environments uh, with the you know um the early adoptions even for some use cases and then of course when it comes to full deployment they will be able to provide the infrastructure required for a full deployment of a ai project and are there any specific gaps in the market that you are trying to fill uh, so basically the gaps that we're trying to fill is really you know to between a hyperscaler and a company who would invest heavily to its ai infrastructure so the idea is that we maximize the roi of this hardware to make it accessible in terms of cost and while keeping data sovereignty so to make sure that the ai companies can handle sensitive data related to healthcare and government financial services and we can provide them at scale whatever compute they need to be able for the ai to scale why have you decided to uh, you know partner with uh, hyperfusion how will it add value to your overall offerings in the market one of the important thing customers are asking us for is to have in country cloud you know they don't want to share their data outside the country so um you know with hyperfusion solution uh, in country this will help us to you know overcome the challenge of the data privacy right and then we will be able to provide together a full solution all the way from the identification of the use case into the adoption of the use case and then the full deployment of the use case so this partnership is very important to be able to provide the customer the full solution rather than providing the use case itself but now uh, let the customer struggle with finding where to host this ai project and of course as i said data very important to have the data in in country so that's why it was very obvious for us that you know we need to partner with uh, with hyperfusion for for us to be able to provide the end to end solution and in terms of uh, partnership why did you choose omnix uh, to be your regional partner so well you know hyperfusion is a bit like a refinery so data for us is our oil we transform it and then we give gas you know gas and kerosene for plant etc so that's kind of like what we focus on but we still need the use cases around it right um for the gas to go into a car into a plane into a train omnix is the car the train the plane so they work with the end clients building the use cases and we plug in to deliver the gas if that makes sense so giving their incredible expertise and reputation it made sense for us to associate ourselves so that they can work with the clients on building their strategy their agents and behind we would deliver the computing at scale and with this collaboration how will it enhance the customer support and service delivery in the in the market it's all about the uh, acceleration of of the adoption when we meet customers one of the challenging point is 
do I have to invest in this infrastructure? Will it give me a return on investment? Uh, how can I get the return on investment fast? Now, we take, we take all these challenges and, 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 and questions and concern out of the, uh, of the equation. And now we focus on, Mr. Customer, you will pay as you go. Uh, you don't have to uh, invest. You don't have to manage the environment at your site. You don't have to have engineers who are, you know, uh, very familiar with a a AI uh, infrastructure. Uh, they don't have to maintain it. So we are taking the burden of the operation from the customer and uh, letting the customer pay as they go. Uh, you know, so which which will then, from my point of view, it will help to accelerate the adoptions of many use cases as we go forward. So uh, according to you, how will this partnership enhance uh, customer support and service delivery in this market? Well, it's a hand-in-hand -hand expertise. So we come from infrastructure play, making sure that we can give the computing as competitive in terms of cost, ROI, but also the Omnix comes hand-in-hand -hand to make sure that the, the solution can actually bring these what we call easy wins to these companies. So that ultimately, we are completely committed to customer success from a uh, cost perspective, but most importantly, in terms of product. And will there be any joint marketing initiatives like events, campaigns, or demos uh, to drive awareness and adoption of these uh, solutions? Of course, this is part of our go-to-market plan with Hyperfusion is the ability for us to uh, you know, participate in different uh, events uh, for that. You know, can be events, can be customer uh, workshops. Uh, customers are asking for, as, as I mentioned, that they want to have a proof of value uh, at one point of time for a smaller AI use case. Uh, so in that case, we can we can support the customer initiative with that. We're using the, the marketing uh, funds that will be available for this. So basically, all the way from participation into event, into uh, uh, exhibitions, as well as in the POV, helping the customer with proof of value uh, for certain uh, um, adoptions and for certain projects and for certain early uh, engagement with customers. So we've been already to the AI festival organized by the IFC, but also AI Everything that was organized by Jitex. Uh, we've been also at the government summit that was organized uh, uh, in March. So we like to big like these landmark events. I think we're going to do like, you know, three or four. Naturally in Jitex, we will do something also in terms of product placement and, uh, and showing what we can do. Uh, thank you, Quinton, for speaking to us. Nice having you with us today. It was great. Thank you. Thank you, Wally, for speaking to us. Nice uh, having you with us today. Thank you very much. Thank you, Chris. Thank you. I appreciate it.